Hi guys, this is Vampress Luna and today I'm coming with the last video of the day. I have recorded a couple videos tonight. I will be uploading all of them tonight before I go to bed because I came home from work. So my kids are asleep so I decided to actually be able to record all these videos that I've been pushing back, 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 back. But today I was like, you know what? I'm going to do it because if not, I'm never going to get it done. So the last video of the day is going to be a Dollar Tree haul. I think this is my dollar, the biggest Dollar Tree haul yet that I've done in a long time. I am surprised now that I'm looking at all of these things in the bags. I'm surprised that I actually walked out with all these items because it's a lot. At least in my opinion. Alright, but let's get started because I don't want this video to be so long. So the first thing that I got was this Essential Papa Pamper. I got this one because it pops up because i had bought another one before but it was kind of like the mesh ones and it's like the ones that don't pop up like it's like you put it there and it just plops on the floor i didn't like it so i decided to get this one that pops up and, and the cute thing about it, it has like a little side pocket so i can put either coins in there or rolled up socks when you're done folding clothes and put them in there <clears throat> but i'm also doing it because that way i can have one hamper in my room so my kids, when they come from school, home from school, they don't automatically throw clothes on the floor or just leave it there and wonder where they're going to put it. I'll have a hamper right next to their bed. Boom. Throw it in there. So if it's good, I will continue buying this one. And they only have this white one. I don't know if they come in different colors, but I only got this in white in my store at least. <clears throat> the next item my daughter picked out because my son was in school with these little buckets with their little pails and my daughter picked this one they had a frozen one and this princess one but she chose the princess one which is a miracle because i thought she was gonna get the frozen one so i got this one for her and she chose the ninja turtle one for her brother so hopefully now that school's almost out maybe i can take them to the beach which I'm not that fond of the beach, but they're bugging me that one. They want to go, so I might take them to the beach so they can play with the little bucket. Another thing that I got, <clears throat> excuse me, that I saw someone haul and I forgot who it was. And I was super excited to find them were these paper plate holders. So we sometimes know that at least I buy paper plates either from the dollar store or from anyone else. But we know that some of these paper plates, when you put food on it, what happens? The first thing you do click breaks goes to the side or the kids dropped or something and it's not so sturdy because my son's six and my daughter's four so they their hands are kind of wobbly when it comes to the paper plates sorry that's my cat <clears throat> so this is a pack of four and i'm very excited because at least these are plastic but they're sturdy so maybe when i put the plate there for them the hold and it's better for them to you know walk around when they're gonna sit or something so they only had the green one I saw that they had like different colored containers next to these and I thought they would have those colors but they didn't they probably ran out. So hopefully, maybe I'll try to go to another Dollar Tree tomorrow, which kind of iffy because I don't want to spend so much money again, which I already spent today. But if they do, I'll probably get another pack of these in a different color for them. So that hopefully will come in handy. <clears throat> Alright, the next thing I got is a gift that I saw cute for my mom which I will include for her Mother's Day gifts and she likes different cloths and things like that for the kitchen so I got this one and it's beautiful I saw it the only thing they didn't have was like the the one you put for your hand in the oven mitt one I believe that's called that's what it's called they only had the um kitchen towel and the pot holders but it didn't have the oven minute one, which I'm, again, I'm kind of upset because it would have been cute for a whole set because some of those sets are pretty pricey. They can go up to like $10 and a dollar each, you know, two pot holders for a dollar and then a dish rag for a dollar. Not bad. So I'm going to try to see if I can go to the other Dollar Tree to find the pot holder for this. <clears throat> I mean, the oven mitt for it. So that will be going along with her Mother's Day gift. Okay. And I'm just pulling things out of the bags in no order in particular because I'm just recording this all in my bed. I have like a whole bunch of stuff as you can see from all the videos that I have recorded today. So keep a look at it on that from Ipsy, Birchbox, and Walmart. So keep a look out on that. And also a video for a Michaels haul that I did. 
So keep an eye out for that as well. <clears throat> All right. The other thing I've been wanting to get, and every time I go, I forget, are these denture cleaners. No, I don't wear dentures. But I did see a video one day on you on Facebook, <clears throat> which I will leave it in the link below, because supposedly denture cleaner tablets are good for cleaning jewelry and i have jewelry here and i know i've tried to clean them with toothpaste and it does work but i don't know it doesn't really get into the nooks and crannies so they say these are good not only for cleaning jewelry but it's good for cleaning your toilet it's good for cleaning your your coffee mug and your coffee pot and all that stuff like sometimes it gets kind of old and your coffee tastes not so fresh you know you can actually clean this is so i will try it and if i do like it i will do my demonstration if that's you, if you guys want that i'll do that as well to see the procedure or the the results again i have the video i have the link of the video i will put it down in the description bar so you guys can watch the video so you can see it for yourself how they actually use these tablets to clean different items around your house okay so not bad for a buck not bad <clears throat> Okay, another thing that I got were my kids love books and they like me reading to them at night. So they have this book for from Disney, Peter Pan. So, I'm, you know, we all know the story, Peter Pan. So I got that for them. So when they go to bed, I can read it to them. Another thing that I got for them is these pudding ice cream sandwich flavored um, pudding snacks. And I kind of got crushed on the way home. So my kids love pudding, so I got that for them, just for them to snack on. <clears throat> Excuse me. Another item I got was this peach and white orchid scented um body mist or body splash or whatever you call it. This is for me because my mom is, doesn't like body splashes, so I'm getting this one for me. And I got her a couple of things from the same line as a mother's day gift because she's she actually likes body lotions and the what do you call it the shower gels but i'm the one that likes the body special so i got that one for myself it smells really good so if you guys see that pick them up because they're good and they run out quick because when i went to the dollar store they didn't have that many left okay so another thing i got which is going to be part of her gift is um bobby pins she uses them all the time and she loses them all the time so i saw a pack of 72 and that's going to be part of her gift for mother's day okay another thing that i saw and this is i found these the other day these are not from this haul these are from an old haul i have a whole bunch of things that i have not made a video of maybe little by little I'll start if not so be it but these are some things that i found around the house and these are the Milani baked eyeshadows that I found. And again, these baked eyeshadows you can use them either wet or dry. And these are beautiful colors that I found around and I got. This one is called Blackout. Okay, and this one here, this beautiful one here, it is called Fusion. This beautiful green one is called Green Fortune sorry about the head cover guys this pretty coppery one is called bronze doll and the last one i have which is similar to this one this one's very light it's called the beach sand and i'm guessing the theme of it or the line was it was is runway eyes because they all have that same i think they have that, the peach one have the same runway eyes on it so you know milani's not a bad line and they are pretty pricey if you go get them in a different place if you find them in the dollar tree you know you'll you'll be good another one i got here again i'm pulling things randomly is this lip gloss from color me and this one i'm guessing has a flavor and this one's called it has the flavor chocolate mint so I'm not really much of a lipstick. I do buy lipsticks, but I prefer more lip glosses than anything. And hopefully these are not like the sticky, icky lip glosses because I don't like those. So hopefully it does say 
um, it is lightweight. So hopefully it'll work out. <clears throat> and those are new. I have not seen those before. I don't know if anyone else has hauled them, but I have not seen those before. <clears throat> so the other thing I got, like I said, was the one for this one, which is the Peach and White Orchid Lotion and the Peach and White Orchid Showering Gel. These are for my mom. And then I got her another set, which is the Aloe Body Lotion. And that is Hibiscus and Exotic Mango. Sounds pretty yummy. And then I got her the um, Shower Gel to go along with it. So that's for her. And I am going to give it to her in this cute little basket. This pink basket I found. So it's kind of like a spa kind of thing. like. I'm going to probably decorate it, but not, you know, but it's pretty good. She can put it in the bathroom. Super cute. <clears throat> Along with the bobby pins, wherever they are. So see, I'm going to give it to her like that. Probably put like a plastic over it, like the plastic to be able to, I don't know what you call those, plastic mesh or something that you wrap around. And the cute thing about it is it has a handle, so it can be kind of like a pampering gift as well for her for Mother's Day. Oops. Okay, another thing I got was this beautiful eh, little thing. I don't know what you call these. Uh, eh, you can put the tea light inside, either the, the real one or the light up ones. But I got the light up candles, the light up um, LED candles because I don't want to have it melt all over the place and i got this for my grandma's altar because she did pass away she's passed away unfortunately three years ago so i got this one for her altar and it says a grandma's heart is full of love so i got that for her you know as a gift for like mother's day even though she's not here with us anymore but i got this for her so i'm gonna put it next to her altar and the tea light goes with it okay i finally found these and i've seen a lot of girls haul these and these are the candle lights um holders and i did get these candles here one for my mom which is the pink one and me i'm gonna have this one for my room which is the purple one and i got these candles are lavender and they smell really good so hopefully it's not like it just smells good and it doesn't when you turn it on it doesn't smell good at all because i've had those a couple of times where it smells really good and then you turn it on and there's no smell at all all right well, let me hurry up because i'm already 12 minutes into the hall and i'm not even halfway done okay the next thing i saw were these set of pens again you guys know i am a penaholic this is like a springtime one this is another springtime but more pastel one and softer with butterflies and this this is another one which is beautiful which i saw which is another like springtime color coordination of pens so i got that so i'm gonna just unfortunately just kind of do this fast because my battery is overheating on my phone okay another thing that i got for my mom one got one from me and one for her was this beautiful scarf it's black and has different colored flowers so i got that for her and one for me so if you guys know the dollar tree has been getting a lot of beautiful items so guys if you have not gone lately go check it out because trust me, you're going to be in awe with all the beautiful items that they have now. Okay. Another thing that I got was another book for my kids. The Lion King. We all know this awesome movie. So, again, I can read it for them before bed. Okay, this is the other lip gloss I was looking for that I got from Color Mates. And this is Raspberry. So, this is like a pink one. It's lightweight provides lasting moisturizer so hopefully these work because sometimes they're either too heavy sticky or they actually dehydrate my lips instead of moisturizing them so hopefully that works okay let's see what else i have here i think i'm in the last bag guys i'm sorry i don't want to make it this too long i think i'm in the last bag yeah so i found four different books that i'm interested in reading their first one i found is undressing the moon from t greenwood and i have bought so many books from there it's not even funny 
And I, unfortunately, I sometimes buy them and I don't read them, but I do want to start reading them because I have like a whole stack. And like, I can do, I can build my own library with all the books I have. So again, this is what it, it's about. If you want, you can just pause the video. Read it. So a little bit in depth, it's like about a girl trying to find her place. I'm guessing because she has cancer or something like that. And she wants to just probably just have a better connection with her family. So again, you can just pause it and read what it's about to me. It really interests me about the book. And then another one I got was The Purple Shroud. And this is like a Egyptian book. And I'm really into Egypt. So I decided to get this one. And again, you can just pause it and read what it's about. Because if not, this video is going to be way longer than what I expect it to be. And then I have seen this at my job because I do actually work at Target and they actually have this one there. And again, as you all know, Dollar Tree, everything is for a dollar. So these books for a buck, you can't beat that. So this one's called The Orchard. And let me see it. That's what it's about. Okay, yeah, that's what it's about. Because sometimes the book is in the inside. The, the review of it. So this is what it's about. And it sounds like a really cute story. And then the last book that I got, which really interested me, which is huge, it's called Niceville. Okay, and it's in the inside, not the back. Okay, so that is what it's about. Okay, you guys want to again pause and read? Make it there. Okay, so that's what it's about. So let me just check my bags to make sure I didn't miss anything. Sorry, I'm so disorganized right now, guys. But again, I have a limited time sometimes. So pretty much that is my huge, to me, huge haul. And that's my cat there sleeping. My huge haul, guys. So, um, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed. And I, you know, sorry for being so long. But again, thanks for always, guys, for guys watching my videos and for your support. So I will see you to the next one. Bye.